Wow, we've got 309 likes already. So I'm gonna start with some liquid clear. This is like, like a clear paint. So this bit isn't very exciting, but um, it needs to be done. So I'm gonna start at the top and just put a very thin coat of liquid clear on. I've got a wobbly, a wobbly easel. Yeah, this is just clear, clear paint. So. So where is everyone watching from? Don't be shy. Let's know, let's know. Got a few little hairs to get off, but it doesn't matter. You can see that going on just about, I think, so. Hey there, I'm watching from West Virginia. Wow, okay. Yeah, so I'm in the UK. Please tap the screen for me, that'd be, that'd be fantastic. And if you can, just press share and then copy link. That really helps out, helps me get seen. Okay, so I've got some liquid clear on there. Not too much. Ashling, nice to have you here. I don't know where the rest of the gang are. Where's the rest of the gang? Okay, so we've got liquid clear on. Now I'm gonna go with some liquid black. This is such a, going to be such a different painting. It really is. So this one's called liquid, liquid black. Look at that. Almost looks a bit like marmite. So the bottom of the board, I'm going to be doing this. Liquid black, yeah, liquid black. Not liquid white tonight. So, yeah. I don't know where the rest of the gang are. There's not many of the, low, of the normals in here. Of the normals? I mean of the regulars. <laughs> okay. So yeah, just applying a, a coat of liquid black. So I've got liquid clear up there, liquid black down here, then I can start painting. So I'm gonna do like a Bob Ross inspired big glacier. Right, so that's, I've been wanting to do this one for some time, but I haven't really felt brave enough and I don't know why I feel braver today, but I just wanted to give it a go. So I'm just gonna blend this out into that. Just pull up to there. I think that'll do me. I think that'll do me. How is everyone? Welcome, yeah, any new people? Nice so far. Lainey, wait, 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 wait. Hopefully you'll enjoy it. Okay, can everyone see the whole picture okay on their phones? Yeah, the whole canvas. How many new things are you gonna try this week? I know, I'm pushing myself to the limit. Pushing myself to the limit. Okay, so let's get some white on the board. No, got to make a sky. Let's get some blue on the board. So I'm going to use Prussian blue. We're going to make a nice little sky. Don't need a lot of paint here. I could have used, well, I can't really use that brush now because I've got black in it, but I'm going to use, um, what kind of brush can I use? This one here. Okay, so I'm just tapping into some blue here, just a little bit. Actually, this will probably do, I only need a little bit, but I really want to bring that down to make it sort of light up. Don't want too much of a dark sky. This is the first time for me to sort of painting, actually no, second time I'm painting onto liquid clear. So this is just blue going onto liquid clear. We're gonna make a nice little sky and hopefully blend that out. Some nice deep blue at the top there. Okay. Jerry, yes, we have another, another one. I can only watch for 10 minutes. Oh, it's such a shame. You're gonna miss so much. 
yes everything goes up on youtube if you click my profile picture um there's a link under there um on my main profile and it'll take you to my youtube channel i think i'll upload them all so you can go back and watch some of them Jerry, 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 how you doing? Okay, let's blend this out. We're gonna blend this out and make a, just sort of blend this out. We're gonna make some happy clouds. I can't wait to start the mount, big mountain. That's what I can't wait to do. Well, it's a, like a glacier. So yeah, I'm braving it tonight. I'm really sort of going with this one. Blending these colours out. Very interesting, um, a very interesting picture, I think. Right, let's get some white on the board. Let's see if I can make some happy little clouds. I'm gonna need a lot of white tonight. A lot of white. So I'm just gonna put a pile there. Okay, looks exciting, yeah. Jack, hello, how are you? Are you a new, a new person here? Good to have you here, don't forget to follow. So I'm going into some white here. It's quite thick. I'm hoping that I can make some nice little clouds. Just do it in circle motions. There's one there, let's have one. One floating around there. And then we're gonna fluff them up. We're gonna fluff them up to make them look better. Okay. We need another fluffing brush, I think. Oh, brilliant, nice one, Jack. So I'm just gonna blend out the bottom of these. Just making them softer down the bottom there. And then we're gonna lift up. That thing's in the way, so I'm gonna have to bring it forward a little bit. Got to go, sorry. Okay, see you next time. I'm gonna lift these up and just fluff them. Actually, they're working out really well with just the liquid clear. And then just a light. You don't need to play around with them too much. Okay, so we've got some little happy clouds at the top there. Okay. Du -du 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 -du. Okay, everyone go mad on the likes if you can. Let's, let's, so I'll just try and put an, like another sort of one there. And maybe one there. Yeah, I think that looks quite nice. I'm blending them out, just a few extra clouds today. And then lift up, fluff them clouds up. Are you happy with the clouds? Uh, Palm, what will you be painting? I'm gonna be doing this. Hopefully um, a big glacier. Hopefully. So, I've got to be brave. I've got to be brave. And figure out what kind of brush I'm gonna use. Probably gonna use this, this brush, I think. I'm gonna put a load of white on. A load of white here. Uh, but first of all, I'm going to do like a little mountain in the background, a bit of blue and black. Let's put black over here. I'm going to make a colour. Okay, so a bit of blue and black, tiny bit. Don't need too much of this. 
gonna make a color here. Maybe a bit of white into that. Yeah, that's nice. So I want, I want sort of a distant sort of mountain colour. There we go. Thank you for the squirrels. Yeah, I've set my um, gift goal uh, as squirrels tonight. Thank you so much. Um, thank you so much. We're miss who are we missing tonight? We're missing Juneberry, a few other people. Thanks for all the gifts, guys. Sorry I couldn't send any more gifts, mate. Thank you for all the gifts that you've sent. Much appreciated. Thank you, I really appreciate that. Are you happy with the clouds? Okay, let's just... Uh, I'm going to put a little mountain somewhere... Hmm, should I change mine and have mine? This is like really distant, so. I just want to scratch in a little bit of paint. Don't want too much. Okay, don't need, don't need too much of that, so I'm gonna leave that like that. June Berry, yes! How are you? Nice to have you here. I was getting a bit worried. So yeah, this is gonna be like a little distant mountain. Yep, I've set the um, gift for squirrels tonight. Thank you very much, Beck. Nice to have you here too. Um, I'm going to head off now, but I'll see you finish the bench you. Yes, Jack, please do. Thank you for the gifts and thank you for being here. Check out my other videos. But yeah, we're gonna do like a big, it's a big one, okay? It's a big glacier. It's a, a painting that I've wanted to do for a while, inspired by Bob Ross. And I've wanted to do it for some time. And I'm giving it a go. Okay. Okay, this is the brave part now. This is the brave part. I might try and just sort of... Uh, just create a little bit of mist coming up there if I can. Just sort of blend that out a little bit. I want to make it so it's not completely not completely um there just a little i'm just making it a little bit blurry that's the idea two hairs and some air a little bit blurry there we go okay let's have a look um watching my on my phone my ipad not working so that's why i'm late Oh no, what's up with your iPad? Is it broken or? Razzmatazz, sorry you're, you're late, that's okay. Yeah guys, I've set the uh, the um, squirrel, squirrels tonight, so that it's a really low one. And hopefully we can complete the goal. Great to see you, yeah, it's great to see you all, it really is. <laughs> Let's see if we can smash them lights up to like 5k or something. Thanks for all these gifts, appreciate it. Well, okay, I've got to be brave now. I've got to be brave. I've got a lot of white to put on, okay? So, I'm gonna get a load of white out. Look at that, plenty of white. I'm just gonna use this brush, okay? Okay, here goes it, be brave, be brave, be brave. Uh, candles Lee, good aerial perspective, thank you. Okay, so come on, let's be brave, let's be brave. I think I'm going to go a little bit higher. I'm going a little bit higher up here. I need to put a lot of paint on. A lot. 
It's very, 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 very thick paint. Okay, now we're... Oops, what's that? Hair. Got hair in my paint. Where's that come from? I even got hair that long. I don't think, anyway. Uh, Pearl, thank you for the uh, ice cubes. Much appreciated. Lovely to have you here. Uh, let's have a look. Anyone, if I've missed any comments, then I'm sorry, or any gifts, follows, and all that, I really appreciate you all. Obviously, I've got two eyes on the painting. And let's go here. Look at this lovely, thick paint. Whoops, right, okay, now it's time to lock this in position. <laughs> okay, this is fun, this is so much fun. Let's go here. This is gonna, this is gonna be one of them pictures that just change so quickly. I'm gonna put a marker sort of down to about there. Well, oh, that's that's dried quite quick actually. That's okay. Don't mind that. That helped me out. Um, Sharon, hello. Nice to have you here. I find your life super interesting, and relaxing. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. It's, yeah, like I say, it's great to have you here. I appreciate all of you. I really, really do. I can't wait to sort of get this one on the way. I've got a lot of white to put on. And then I'll be blending about with colours and all sorts. So that black that I've put on, liquid black, has really soaked into the board. And that's going to help me out, actually. If it was wet, it doesn't matter. But because it's drying quite quickly, that's going to help me out. Yep, yeah, I'll set the squirrels tonight, so we've got a target. I'm hoping we'll get there. What have we got? So I can't see the target because I'm, I'm sort of too sort of close. Okay, let's go. Let's have a bit coming out there. I can sort of neaten them up in a bit. If you wonder what that noise is, it's me. Super, super thick paint. Super thick paint. Okay, let's just have this one coming down to about there. I think I'm kind of all right now. Okay. Oh, this is going to be fun, this bit, I tell you, this is going to be fun. I tell you what, let's come out a little bit further there. I can really sort of start to play with these bits now. I'll leave that bit. Where's that hair come from? How can I have a hair that long? It's probably one of my nose ones, to be fair. <laughs> Who knows at this age? <laughs> Thank you for all the gifts. Sharon, yeah, this is really different. It's one that I've wanted to do or try for a long time. Okay. Yeah, different techniques, a lot of different te techniques this week. Well, I'm just gonna stop there and I'm gonna put this color on now and hopefully it will start transforming you can see exactly what it's going to be and i can come back and play with that bit so i'm laying everything out at the moment so i want some dark i've got some black here with a tiny tiny bit of blue in it and i've got loads of paint over the handle how is everyone how is everybody sound effects always needed absolutely thank you thanks for these gifts i really appreciate it Okay, now let's have some fun. Do, 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 steady hand. In there. 
Okay, I'm gonna tidy up, tidy up some bits, but hopefully you'll be able to sort of see what's going on. Okay, let's go in here. Just a little bit. Very, very thick paint. We'll tidy up some little bits here and there. I love the sound of the paint going on the canvas. I really, really do. What we like, 5.9 thousand lights. We got a long way to go. I can add some white here and there. Okay, bring that down to about there. I love this uh, thick paint I'm using tonight. Let's go about there. Let's put a little thing there and have it going there. Okay, let's just fill this in. Really scratching that into the canvas. I never thought I'd paint with a knife, but I'm doing it. Right, so yeah, I've got the initial outline now. Hopefully it'll get sort of better and better as it goes along. That's the idea. I'm gonna go and get my little tiny knife. My head is like, does not compute right now. I can't wait to see. Okay, yeah, hopefully it, it's, it's one of them paints that should come together in the end. Should do. Should do. It looks a bit messy at the minute, but hopefully it should come together. I'm looking for my small palette knife. There. Okay, so, small palette knife. Okay. Yeah, once I put the shade in and stuff like that on, it should be quite cool, I think. Right, so now, let's get, let's get a little, one of these fine brushes. I think I might use that one. This might help me. Uh, you, no, no one can work out what it is yet. <laughs> okay. Okay. This this brush is nice. I think June got me these. Thank you, June. Right, when I start putting some highlights and stuff, hopefully you'll start sort of seeing it. Need to roughen up some of these edges. Okay. Yes, absolutely, what are you making? Yeah, yeah, I think you can all see now it, what it's gonna be. Early stages, but you know. You should be able to hopefully get it as I go along. It should be easier to sort of see. Okay, we're going to scratch in some. Let's scratch in some colour and see what happens. So much to do yet, but uh, it'll all sort of come together. I'm not going to play about too much of them. This I need to put a lot of. I need to put a lot of colour on this white yet, so. Probably end up putting some liquid clear on and 
very, very, very thick paint. This is. I've got quite a few paint bogies in there to get off. Polar bear's paw. Yeah, let's call it that. <laughs> I, I saw that as soon as I read that. I saw it as soon as I read it. Okay, now, okay. Right, let's neaten up some little edges. Let's see if I can use one of these brushes. I'm going to use a lot of brushes tonight to be fair right okay let's well what should I do now let's uh, put some more sort of black around this area okay now I've got to make a color for the side and I think I've got the color of the same color as that mountain over there all right okay I need to make two colors I'm gonna nab a bit of this, nab a bit of white. I'll try and show you guys here a bit more white. I think that'll be nice. Okay, now this is start making it look a bit better. Thanks for everyone. Um, tapping the screen, sending me gifts and everything, much appreciated. How's the goal looking? I can't even see the goal every time I look. Up there somewhere. Okay, now. We're just touching a bit of colour there. And that should make it look a little bit thicker. I'm hoping. <laughs> So the idea is that that's like the edge of the, so it's sort of thickening up the sort of snow sort of thing. Two, four, three for the f for the goal now. Thank you so much. Another boss round here too. Oh, nice to have you here, Steve. Thank you. Right, I think I'll I'll just like leave that bit there. Let's start dragging some, let's sort this snow out. It's time to sort the snow out. I want that looking a bit better. So I'm gonna get the magic white out. We've got some blues on the board and all that kind of stuff, so. I've got a little brush out. I might just try using that first. Brighten some of them up. We're gonna add some blue in here and stuff, so. Can everyone see what it's going to be? What it's building up to be? We're going to add some blue in there and all sorts. Do, 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 do. I need to put the, um, once I put the, that side on there, it should look, you know, Hopefully you can see more of what it's gonna be. Putting loads of liquid clear on here. It just flows like really nicely. We can add some more little cracks here and there. I'm gonna just put that bit straight. I don't really like that bit. So I'm just gonna put that straight. That's a good thing about painting. I mean, you can just try stuff. And if you're not happy, Get rid of it. It's not that hard. Yes, this is going to be snow. That's it. 
We're gonna add some different flavors in here in a minute. I like to call them flavors. Not that I eat my paint or anything, but just, uh, you know. Come down to about here. Okay, I've got loads of paint on there now. All right, let's just go into some blue. Start putting some blue in there. Like shadows. It's weird, I think when I was younger and you thought about painting snow, you think you're gonna paint snow and you're gonna be using white, but you can use blue, all the colors of the sky and stuff like that. Pain is in the extension to absolutely, absolutely. I love painting. Like I started last year, and absolutely love it. And it's learning. I don't mind coming on here and just trying trying stuff I haven't tried before. I don't mind. Just a little bit in there, maybe. Maybe just a little bit too much there. But yeah, angles are important because I'm doing it like a smiley face, you know? And then you can just blend them out a little bit, hopefully. What's that on there? Picked up a little bit of red on my brush, but it should be okay. Let's just try and just gently going over that now. Yeah, this one, um, you know, I was watching Bob Ross and he done a big glacier like this, and I'm literally trying to do it like that. So, and then hopefully I can learn learn from this with a bit of luck. Um, Hello Mel, how you doing? Fizz, how you doing? I'm doing a Bobby Rossi one. Okay, now let's scrape some colour on this side of here and hopefully it will start looking a bit. Come on, come on, come on. Let's start up here. Steady hand. Might have to change the colour a little bit. Oh yeah, that's nice. Making it marbly. I caught a little bit of you last night, mate. Um, did it? Yes, 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 yes. Good one, Fizz. I'm giving it a go. <laughs> I've wanted to give it a go for so long. So long. Okay, let's just... Uh, I'm hoping you're going to see this. I've got to get the colour right. I don't want too light. I don't want too dark. Maybe some marbly. I'm, I'm, let me show you. So I've got that light and I'm picking up a bit of this light. Just scraping it over the top of the paint, it makes it marbly and then just cutting across. And I'm hoping that I can drag that on. Got to get right up to there. I think it's very, very, very shiny from where you're looking. And it's not the best angle for me to hold the knife, to be honest. But, it's kind of getting there, I think. See, it's coming together a little bit more now. Hopefully you can kind of see what I'm trying to do. Um, what are you thinking, guys? <laughs> what are you thinking? You're thinking 
this one is a very different one. We're gonna have, I'm gonna darken this bit down here, so I'm not really bothered about how much I put here. Okay, now, let's just change that a little bit now. A bit of a lighter colour. And then we're gonna go somewhere here. Really just doing my own kind of version of it. It's, it's uh, quite cool to do. Uh, let's have a look at all this. Can see it already. Good. I'm, I'm glad you can kind of see. I'm glad you can kind of see. Big. It's like a massive sort of version of um, mountains, really. Like really sort of close up. Right, where's that fine detail thing here? Yeah. Okay, let's try and neaten some of these up. Some little cracks going in there. So yeah, adding that sort of layer there is supposed to be like the thickness of the snow. So, thank you, it's getting there, isn't it? Thank you, Steve, thank you. Yeah, I'm giving it a go. I, 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 you know, you know, on my lives, sometimes they've gone a little bit, a little bit wrong, but most of the time I think I've managed to sort them out, but I just wanted to give this a go. Be brave. here and there. This is one that I've I've wanted to do for a very, very long time. And you have to be brave. Just put a little crack here and there. So interesting palette, look, white, black, and blue, and then mixed just between all of them. Okay. Okay, is there anything else I can, maybe just a few at the top. I think these little cracks really sort of help. So we can sort of put one here maybe. I think that, that that kind of adds to it, I think. What do you think? Um, I, uh, let's go back, let's go like this. You have done well. Thank you very much, June. Thank you so much. What are we like, 12.7K, thank you guys. So these little fine detail brushes are actually really, really good. Thank you for getting these June off of my Amazon wish list. They really, really have helped, I think. It really is nice to um, Try something different. 
I could have had this really dark that side, but um, you know, right, hang on, let's put a load of, I'm just gonna put some dark blue down here. It's like a real sort of close up of the side of the mountain, isn't it? Uh, you are really good in all your paintings, top. Oh, thank you so much, I appreciate that. I really appreciate that, thank you. Right, I just need to, I just need to clean the brush out. I won't do a minute, guys, but I must clean it out because I need to use it. Long. Is everyone still there? <laughs> so yeah, I think this is the first time I've painted on this size up that way as well. So I'll just put some blue there. I just want to bring some mist up there. making some mist. Making them noises really helped me actually. Beat the devil out of it, Bob. Yeah, absolutely. I just, I always say that to my, to myself when, when I'm doing it. I really do. That's all I can hear. When I clean the brushes out is, you know, beat the devil out of it. Okay, so. Just do a little bit more mist in there. That bit's probably gonna be covered. No, I've got, I've got a bit of a, I've done this quite big actually, to be fair. Um, I need a bit more canvas, I might, I'm going to stick a bit on the bottom. <laughs> I don't know if I can do that. All right, let's just clean this out. It should be okay. I might sort of bring it up a little bit, so I might paint some over some of that. Just misting some of this out now. Listening to your little noises makes me smile. Oh, June, thank you. I hope they're noises from my mouth. <laughs> I'm terrible, aren't I? Well, I hope so. You never know, but as you get older, you don't know where these noises come from. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay, so, right, okay, let's think. So I might scrape some of this bit off because it's I've done a bit I've done it a bit too bigger than what I was planned basically. So I just might scrape a bit off. I can see a bit of mist. I want to be up to about there I think. So yeah I'm gonna scrape a little bit of paint off here. That just makes it easier obviously for painting over. Look. Look at that, I can put that back on there, look. Nothing wrong with that. Okay. And um, we can put a little bit of dark back there. I guess use a let's use a bigger brush, shall we? If I can find the brush I've done it with. There. It doesn't really matter about this bit, I just want it darker, darker underneath, so it goes about there. It's like an under sort of coat. Okay, that's fine. Um, love your sense of humour, thank you so much. Mel, oh, we've got a few crying faces there. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, I'm older but not telling. <laughs> it's the bubble noises, isn't it? That's when you've got to worry. 
That's when you've got to worry if you start sounding like bubbles. <laughs> I don't know who puts these ideas in my head. Terrible. Okay. Right, okay, let's put... Um, right, we're getting there, guys, we're getting there. Right, there's a little rock that lives up there. Little rock that lives up here. I think um, my pallet knife's bent somehow. I'll tell you what. I don't know how my pallet knife went, but there we go. A little rock lives there. Okay, we can neaten that up a little bit with some kind of brush. Carl, look at my mum telling me off, look. Okay, right, okay, let's grab a little bit of that, um, a little bit of this, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. He's quite happy sat there, look. A little rock up there. And we're gonna grab the uh, white now. This is white, okay. Where's the magic white over here? Yeah, it's the same sort of layout as Bob Ross's, but um, I've done mine quite big to be fair, but that's okay. Let's just pull some of that across. Bit of a shadow. A little bit of snow here and there. We don't know. The little rocks just sticking out there. How'd you like that? How'd you like now? How'd you like now? <laughs> Good evening, really nice to see you this evening. It's so different coming out really nicely. Thank you. So you can see, you can see now, can't you? It really is something different, but. Yeah, see that one over there? It's really distant, isn't it? That, that one there. We can put some more sort of, um, sort of go into this colour here. Let's just put a bit more there, look. Just them bits of blues in a painting like this, you know. And with the angle of the brush, I'm going like a smiley face. Okay. And that gives you the shadows of the snow going in and out, so. I could have done it darker over here, but I decided to do it light. I decided to do it light, I just wanted to see it, see it a bit more, so. Um, is it? I wouldn't miss him, thanks June. <laughs> thank you. Well, okay, now the, now the palette's gonna change, it really is. We're gonna have some hills and stuff like that, so I might even use my other palette just to make my life easier. I put that over there. I'm gonna get my other palette and just crack on with it. I can add some little details here and there. Right, okay, let's go with some, is that still central? Yep. So I'm gonna get some different colors out on here. We've got some yellow, nearly out of this yellow, but I've got a couple of tubes, thank you guys. Um, some yellow ochre. You know, the standard sort of greens and Sap green, that's a good one. Got sap green here. This is gonna be interesting now. 
It's going to start to get interesting. Okay. Uh, Melly Mel, thank you so much. I've got like the basic of that done now, and if I want to go and touch anything in and change it, I can. I want to move on and lay out the picture, and then I can sort of play about, play about here and there. Blend that out, look. Right guys, I've got something to tell you. Um, I've decided, you know my face reveal is at 25,000. So um, I've made a video today that shows me, but I've kind of got a mask on, like one of these filters. So I'm gonna post that over the weekend. So you'll see 50% of me, okay? 50%. Now if you unfollow, I understand. Um, but yeah, it's, it's kind of a, it's kind of a film sort of. I've done. The, I've used the thing of, out of a film and tried to make a bit of video, video out of it. So hopefully, you look out for that. So we got some green. We got some yellows. Green, some yellows. Want quite. Yeah, that's quite nice, isn't it? Okay. Now let's lay out the land. So we want to come to about. Here. See what I mean? We're losing quite a bit of of that, but it doesn't matter. It's what I planned. You can just see a little hint of that going down there. Maybe there's a hill coming across there. So I'm laying out the land now. We'll add some different colour there I think as well. Okay, so let's have that coming down. See I want it dark underneath, so then it allows you to put this green on which makes it quite easier. Need some more yellow, surprise, surprise. That green really pops out lovely, yeah. Back was chatting, sorry, that's all right. Lovely jubbly. That's okay, nice to have you back. Thank you, oh, that's so cool, thanks everyone. Thank you. How's the old squirrel goal looking? I've done squirrels tonight, because they're like half a pea or something. Okay, let's go. Let's. Okay. So let's put, I'll tell you what, we're gonna have, there's a couple of rocks here and a rock there. So I'm gonna come with this over there. I need dark on there because that, that bit was white, so I'll just I can play about these colours. Just put a load of green on. Okay, let's lay some rocks in, so I know where they are. Uh, don't really need to use that. I think I've sat on my paint knife. It's a bit bent. Can everyone? What's the shares like tonight? Sixty-two. Let's go if we can. There's, how many of us here? There's twenty, so twenty-three of us, I think. It's if, if everyone can just, you know, tap share and then copy link, that'd be brilliant. Thank you. That'd be fantastic. Thank you, guys. That it does help out though. The more you do that, it really helps out, like getting seen and stuff. So, which, okay, burnt umber or some Van Dyke brown. Let's go with Van Dyke brown. So I've got some Van Dyke Brown, just neat Van Dyke Brown. And let's just put a couple of, I'm gonna have to move this. Thank you so much for sharing, much appreciated. Yeah, we're still gonna play about with that, but um, you know, it's gonna. So let's have a couple of rocks. Let's go somewhere about here. And let's have a bit of this. 
So I'm just dragging some brown. I'm just putting brown on there. And they're gonna have some over here. And you know, you know, you know what happens now. We get some white. And we're gonna make a lighter color of that. Well, a lot lighter, white, and look, watch. So we're making it sort of marbly. A little bit more brown in there. That's it. See how marbly that is? Cut across. I'm gonna put some highlights on here. Just make some nice little rocks there. So I'm doing this before because you can put the, the green all the way round, so it makes it a lot easier. Okay, now where's that blue? Okay, I kind of run out of blue anyway, so I'll just put some fresh on the board. So we're gonna go with some um, blue, some phalo blue, just a touch, and, and, hint, of green. Yeah, thanks for, well, thanks for everyone sharing. Sorry if I made you jump. I nearly got attacked by this. I mean, you have to watch this one, I'll tell you. Violent, violent, absolutely violent. So I've got some blue. I'm gonna nick a little bit of green here. Tad, blue and green. Blue and green. And we're gonna put some here. Some blue and green, okay? And here. Oh, coal didn't make enough, so he's gonna make some more. Blue and green. Okay. So we're gonna lay this, lay this out here. So you know what's coming. You know what's gonna be here. Is everyone falling asleep? So we've got that blue down there now. So you know what's gonna go there, like I said. So we're gonna have some there. Okay. Should be able to pick off all different colors there. Carlin, it's that time of night. What did everyone have for dinner? What did you all have for dinner? I want to know. All right, let's carry on. Going in with some yellow now. I'm gonna drag some of them over. That really does make a nice. Okay, I'm gonna go into some ochre here as well. the way this comes together now. Oh, here we go. Oh, good, all wide awake. Good, nice one, June. Um, Grace, oh, Grace is still wide awake. Mumsy, Aislin, yes. Cheese sandwich, lovely jubbly. Uh, tooth, tofu sandwich, nice one. What about you, Carl? Oh, don't ask me, I thought that was, that was like, what, two hours ago? How am I supposed to remember that? Um, I had egg on toast. There you go, I remembered. I had egg on toast tonight because I had, uh, what did I have earlier? Yeah, I went to Greg's and I had like a sausage roll. So, I need to clamp this down now. So doesn't the, um, the, the you know, these overhangs onto these rocks, it 
whatever it is. That's why I do the rocks first. And then we come down straight down. Uh, let's have a look. Sauce and chips. Oh, nice get the nice one. Yeah, I had tiger bread. I bought some tiger bread the other day, and it was just so, so good. And last night before I went to bed, I had a craving for it. So I had like two big thick bits of toast before I went to bed last night. Shouldn't have really, but you only live once. <laughs> So yeah, I've got some little yellow ochre on here. Just coming down there. Just onto there. And let's have some more yellow. Haven't had tiger bread in ages. Yeah, love that, Sharon. Thank you. Um, yeah, it's. I was looking up what gives the taste. Does anyone know what gives the taste? You know the taste of it. We don't know where that come, where that comes. Going some more yellow. So I'm just tapping, tap, 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 tap this green on. And you know what? I'm going to put some more rocks here. I think some more rocks. Okay, so I might as well do the water. I think. Yeah, does anyone know where the, the what the taste is of tiger bread? I'm gonna go. I think I might go and get some. It's so tasty. It is nice though. It makes good toast. Let's just put a few more rocks here. Coming down with the brown. Okay, that'll do. And then you know what we do now. No, oh, no one knows. Okay, so I had to Google this obviously, but um, find out the answer in part two. Um, no, it's um, rice paste and something, some kind of flour or something. But I know it's flipping nice, I tell you. Steve, how you doing? Nice to have you here. Have you been out tonight, Steve? Have you been out and about? Okay, there's our, some more rocks there. So, let's just carry on with this. We can come down now and put some little overhangs. Go into some yellow ochre. I really like doing this kind of um, painting where it overhangs the rocks. I like doing that. Um, Ashling, um, your painting that's on the way to you it's got this in it hasn't it over like little overhangs of uh, colour and let's go just a little bit darker there go into some light colour Love the way that looks with a little sort of. Okay, now let's get the magic white out and have some fun. Tiff Taff, how you doing? We're still here. Uh, Carol says, amazing. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, thank you. I'll tell you what, Ashling, this is, they'll make a good pair. <laughs> Oh dear. 
Right, okay, let's do the water, okay? Let's have some fun. Yeah, how you doing, Tiff Taff? Nice to have you here. Um, did he, did he, did he? Don't tempt me. Oh, I'll tempt you. Here comes a laugh. <laughs> okay, come on, let's make a little, uh, let's do this water now. Into, in, into the liquid white. Let's just put a bit on the board, so I've got some there. Don't want it too sort of wet, but. I'm hoping, I'm hoping. So the rest, that's the reason why I put the blue there. I'll try and get some hints of white in there. I'm quite surprised how quickly that dried, that um, thingy, that, um, what do you call it, um, you know, uh, liquid black. Okay, not too much paint on here now. Let's get some edges up there. Look. This is always a fun part. Now, I'm, I've just learned something here, right? I'm loading this brush up, right? And I've got a lot of paint right in the corner there. Like, so there's a thick bit there, right? Just there. And it's pushing up against the side of these cliffs and it's giving me some white little, look, some little white, where it's hitting the, that's good, I like it. So there, I like that, I like that, I've learned something. All good with you, good, good, good. Love the waterfall, thank you. Thank you guys. Thanks to everyone that sent gifts tonight. I can't read what it says there. We were at four, is that 400 and something? That's pretty cool, thank you. Joey Simmons, thank you so much. That's the best tip anyone has ever given me. Joey, you're welcome. <laughs> That's a tenner though, okay? You can pay installments. I've just learned that. It's, it actually really works well. The way that went on, so I'm gonna use it on the other side. We're gonna have some splashes here. Not too much paint, not too much paint. I keep forgetting there's blue under there. That's it. Now it's a bit different the other side because it's, I'm right-handed and that's. If I can't do it this side as well as that side, I can add it in. Yeah, I can't. I'll just add it in. You notice I'm leaving the little bits of little bits of black here and there. Oh well done. Uh da -da 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 -da. Da -da 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 -da. Thank you so much, Ashling, thank you. You're oh two eight nine out of yeah, I don't even get to two thousand five hundred, but I thought I'd set a low a low paying one tonight because I you know is it a penny or half a penny? Okay, now let's Go over here. Okay. Oh, let's just put this in. We can have some fun. Right, we need some splashes at the bottom of the waterfall. Right, it just comes through there. There's a little waterfall there as well, look. And we have some stones underneath here. Look, it's hitting some boulders here and there. There's some stones under the water that we can't see. There we go. Magic white's good, I mean, stuff like this is brilliant. Uh, great water technique as well, doing besides first like that. Thank you so much, I appreciate that. This painting is awesome, thank you. Tiff Tuff, beautiful. I see it works very well. Thank you, everyone. 
Right, white water rafting. Let's go, Steve. Let's do it. Does it work if I don't make the sound? Huh? No, you have to make the sound. You have to. Definitely. Right, some little splashes. So yeah, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not leaving some of the dark in there. No, we've got to do the splashes down here. Whiter there in places. Adding a little bit of white. I'm not killing all the dark. It is a fantastic technique though. The wet on wet, it really is. Okay, right, I'm gonna go, like I said, I'm gonna go back over there and just put some little white, white in. You can make, see how that's changed that? You can change the bottom of these rocks. You can have little indentations. Do what you like. Right, let's go into some white. Yeah, I'm gonna finish the waterfall. I'm just gonna add some more white. I want it sort of, you know, I want it looking I quite like the waves I've got there. I don't want to put too much on, but I'm going to have some trees here, you see, so you won't see too much, but just some hints of white. I like, it, like the way it goes down there and then, but yeah, like I said, there's going to be trees there. So I might fiddle about that afterwards. I've just noticed the sky, that's awesome. Thank you so much, much appreciated. Yeah, we're going to put some trees there and little stuff. So we'll do that first and see what's left of the waterfall. Let's have a look at it. I'm just going to have a little look at it. It's kind of looking okay. I mean, I think I might just put a rock, a rock down here just to finish that off. Yeah, another little rock there. Just finish that off. Ooh. Got some very dark green on there. I'm gonna go over, over some of these, I think, with some more yellow and stuff, but that, um, yeah, I'm gonna go over that bit. I quite like the light bit there because it's obviously shining down from the glacier. Um, I struggle with clouds. What brush do you use for clouds? Um, so, yeah, I mean, you can use any brush, but I'd say to put it on with, try a fan brush. That's what I used on this one, actually. So quite a st stiff sort of fan brush. You can see how stiff that is. And then go, the thing with clouds, you get your paint on that bit really, right? And do circles. It's easy to stop and I still stop myself, but you, if you carry on doing circles and move about, always circles, always circles. And then of course you fluff out the bottoms, try and leave these white bits at the top, at the, at the top, at the top and then gently fluff up in a circle motion to get these little fluffy bits. And I've done one in front of this one here today. Yeah, just to make it, hopefully that helps. Um, but I did, um, if I show you some of my early clouds before I go offline, you'll see that just keep going at it and, you, and you'll love it. Can you put some rocks in small to large? Small to large. Well, in here, I could put a little rock in there, actually, couldn't I? Just needed a little something there. Oh, okay, let's let's make some little happy trees. Do I need this white anymore? There's a bit there that could have a bit of snow. Do you know about the snow? Yeah, this is the first time I've done this size canvas up that way. Is that vertical? Yeah, it is. I think it's vertical, isn't it? Okay, let's make some trees. Need a fan brush. I think the fan. I think the fan brush. 
Maybe I can use this one. I'm gonna put a tr couple of trees here. I'm gonna use this one. Go into some sap green. I think I know the progression of rock. Yeah, I might put um, a few rocks in the river. We'll see what happens. Well, I've got some sap green here. Hopefully I've got enough for like I've got to figure out where I want these trees. There was there was no trees in Bob Ross's, but I want trees. I want trees. I want one there. And a little one. Some little ones here and there. They're growing right over there. A bit of a shadow. Um, I don't know if I need one more or not. I don't. I don't know if I need any more trees. We'll put a rock up here. We'll put a rock there, right just there. I think that's a good place for it. Thank you very much, uh, Joey. Yeah, it's nice vertical, isn't it? It's, um, yeah, let's put a... Let's just put a little rock that lives there. I'll tell you what, let's use... I don't know why I struggle with a big... I keep forgetting I've got these new... Um... I've got these new little... A little rock that lives there, and we need to put some mini, mini highlights on him. Okay, a rock here and there. Look at that. Is everyone liking it? Is everyone liking it? Shared side, shared side of mountain. What colour you use? Um, well, this side of the mountain here, um, I used um, Prussian blue and black, and then I mixed the colours in between that as well. So, yeah, I might do some more work around there. Yeah, in some some of these areas, but um, yeah. Oh, shaded. Yeah, I've got ya. I probably read it wrong. <laughs> My eyes and all that. Okay, let's put some more little rocks in here and there. Quite like doing rocks actually. Let's just put one that lives in here. And we need some highlights on him. one there yeah a little rock here and a little rock there let's have one up there look one of them just there little tiny one thank you june for getting me these, these little uh palette knives they're very 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 good to use just a touch maybe just a sparkle of white on this one look jerry thank you for the squirrels Sorry, being completely distracted by my daughter and fiance. I'm back for real good. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for these gifts. Much appreciated. Right, let's think. Maybe we should have a. Um, we could have a bit of a rock showing through there. Look. This all adds to. You can do whatever you like. That's the good thing about it, isn't it? That's it, and you can just drag, again, you can just drag this colour over just around the bottom, maybe up onto it here and there. All right, let's get some yellow ochre, and we're going to just dump some bits here. There 
This is very nice painting tonight. One I've wanted to do for ages. And it's turned out quite well, I think. Uh, this has a different amount of view, I like it. Yes, yeah, so different, isn't it? Really, really different. And you know me, I like to challenge myself, so. You know, it's gotta be done. Quite like the way that that's quite light over there and comes a bit darker here and there. Um, right, let's get some yellow out. I feel I feel there's lots of little things to do now. So the majority is done, but I feel like there's just some little bits here and there that I need to do. So yeah, where's the yellow ochre? Oh look, the yellow ochre's underneath there. Right, let's see what brushes I've got out. I've got some white. Let's get some more yellow ochre, because I love the look of that on the trees. I've just used my um I've used my water brush to do this, that's annoying. But there we go, it doesn't matter. Let's just see what this looks like. Some little highlights here and there. Just touch, touch. Um, let's just dampen that down a bit. I think there's too much there. Too much. Okay. Give him a bit of a a bit of a stem there. Thank you. Perfect. Oh, thank you. Not too busy. It's perfect as it is. Thank you so much. That would be awesome. I like her in the front as well. Thank you. Yes. That's perfect. Uh, da, 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 this is different. Okay, I think I'm up with the comments now. Uh, okay, now. Da, 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 da. Yeah, let's go into some yellow. I just want to dab, dab some yellow about here and there. Just some little brighter colours. Well, it's not actual, com completely yellow, but just some little things growing down there. It's quite nice, isn't it? Same over this side. Oh, this is always awkward, this side. I've got the lights this side. Some little stringy things. That's quite nice, isn't it? I like that. Just brighten up this top bit here. As that comes down there, so it fades in a little bit. Tap, tap, tap. <laughs> I'm going to ski down the mountain. Yay, let's go. We'll all be sat down the bottom having a picnic waiting for you. <laughs> right, okay. Um, there's a few things I can neaten up, definitely. Um, I've just got the one tree. The one tree there, I think it looks okay, just one. <laughs> this this bit need this bit this bit here needs a bit of a bottom to it, there you go. That's alright. Okay, okay, I've just spotted another thing that I need to do. Let's just go into this colour. Mixture of both. There's a little bit here. I just need some in there. That almost looks like it goes round that way. I, th I think. I think. 
So, I suppose I'm just gonna neaten some stuff up now. Um, there's my little thing. I think we need a little bit of, just a little bit of, too much, but it needed something there. But it's just a bit too much. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da 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 -da. I need a drink. Right, I'm going to carry on and just neaten a few things up. <clears throat> I wonder if I can use that brush. I quite like, like using the fan brush to... Um, cut in actually. I don't mind cutting in with a fan brush. I think I've done quite well tonight actually. Just a few bits here and there. We can just neaten some of these up. So I'm using the magic white here it really does flow quite easy. Try not to loot, try not to um, aggravate the, the lines too much. There's a little sharp point there. I'm gonna have to get rid of that bit. Just put that there like that, there we go. Very enjoyable. Very enjoyable. Okay, and then this bit here needs something. Let's just see what will be a few bits of... Let's think of where the light's coming from. Yeah. Well, 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 you got a glacier point down. Oh, thanks, uh, Mick, much appreciated. I wanted to give this one a go for ages. And obviously Bob made it look so good. <laughs> and I wanted to give, I braved it, mate. I've braved it and done it live. <gasps> what am I like? It's, it's, the, it's the same sort of layout, but I mean, it's. I've made this light instead of dark. I've got this bit different. I've got some trees in it. But yeah, it's just, it, it's just, uh, so you can make all different kinds of, play about with this. So we've got a bit there as well, I can just muck about with. There we go. Quite like the shadowing up there. So I've got blue and white on, on that up there for the rock up there. I feel like the top should be a bit more white because that was where some snow would sit, isn't it? Isn't it? I'm just gonna stand back and have a little look. You always rock, you do it. No wor no, no worries, nothing, you did it. Cheers. <laughs> Thanks, buddy, much appreciate it. I love that uh, ship you did. Right, I'm gonna have a look. I'm gonna have a little look and see, oh wow, from a distance, I'm quite happy with that. So you're about a foot and a half away, so you're like really close. So, yeah, when I've come stood back over here, I feel like some of them cracks could be a bit more on point. So I'm gonna try and do that. I might try with the script brush and some thinners. I'm gonna have a good crack at that. That's what I'm going to crack on with. Yeah, I want to, but I want to paint some more ships. Uh, not more ships. I want to have a go at ships. I want to try some animals, not just silhouette. You know. Um, let's just have a little bit of. I'm going to get some uh, liquid black out. Okay, 
Okay, I'm hoping I'll do this okay. I don't wanna, I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have to put it in with a little bit of gray, I think. But hopefully I can get some really thin, thin lines, hopefully. Now I do need a bit of paint thinners. Right, okay. Little drop there. And a little bit. I'm gonna go into this grey that I made earlier as well. I don't want it to. I'm hoping I can just drag some like little bits in. Now I need somewhere to put my hand to do it. I'm gonna have to use, try and use my other hand and just drag some of these in. I feel like my brush is splitting again. Sorry if I'm not reading chat, I'm just like really into this painting at the moment. Okay, let's go. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is so cool, looking good. Thank you, Keith Potts. Nice to have you here. Oh, I wish that wouldn't split. I need a new script brush, I think. Do -do 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 -do. Very, very enjoyable. Very enjoyable to do. See, that's why you stand back and look at a painting. You can see all these little things that I like it, I like it, I like it, I like it. I'll come down a little bit further than what I wanted on that one, but that was a bit of a slip of the old wrist. But it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Actually, I'm going to change that bit, I don't like it. I don't like that bit. Um, Jerry, you're still here, thank you. Everyone's still awake? 16, we've got 16 watchers tonight. It's gone down tonight. I think if, this is more detailed, isn't it? So it takes longer. Okay, so let's go. Okay, we can have one here. Okay, what do you think to that, guys? Uh, da -da 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 -da. Was that, there was 83 when I joined. Yeah, I think everyone's just, um, everyone's had enough. <laughs> everyone's had enough. Da -da 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 -da. I think once the um, comment starts going quiet and, um, the comments, the likes, the shares, and then TikTok's algorithm think, oh well. Sharon Watson, stop, t stop telling what to do. Yeah, I mean, when people paint, um, 
it's very important for you to do your own painting and not and not listen to people telling you what to do they can advise you but that's the way they would do it so and it, it you know you can pick up some things and think yeah actually i'll love that in the painting but um it's very important to produce your own when you're doing art you're doing it to it's your art you're not doing it to please someone you're doing it to please your your eye and it's very important i think to remember that I'm admiring it still here. Oh, well done, Steve. Thank you, guys. Uh, right, okay. And again, I'm just going to remove that bit. I think I'm basically done. I think uh, I'm just going to have a little look here and there and just think about what else I could possibly do. Yeah, so that bit earlier, I just, I went over this because I wanted this very, so foggy, like, yeah, look at that, see? Almost like there's a bit of cloud around the top of that mountain, a little brush here and there. Thank you. Right, okay, let's have a look, let's have a look, okay. I I can see some little things there. I'm nearly done now, guys. I'm nearly done. So I'm gonna bring some of that here, don't that. Uh, what else? Some bits here. Maybe there's a little bit of moss growing on there, look. A little bit here. Dampen some of that down. A little bit there. Oh look, see there's a bit there. This bit needs some this bit needs some hangy downs. Right. Where shall I sign it? Left or right, I think I'll probably have to go down the left, I think. Right, so yeah, I'm gonna side down the left. I think I think basically I'm done. I, I think um, I've given it a good go. It was a blank canvas about whatever time I started. I can't remember. I don't know what time is. I don't know what time is at all. So here we go. Do, 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 do. There we go. It's fabulous, darling. Thank you. <laughs> it reminds me of uh, that um, fabulous, darling. Um, what was it? Joanna Lumley and the other one. Uh, let's have a look. Let's have a look at this. I don't know if there's any more I can do to it or not. There might be some little tweaks here and there, but um, I think I'm pretty happy with it. I think I'm pretty happy with that. Let's go move the iPad out of the way. Right up there for a minute. Birds of feathers? <laughs> oh, yeah, could have been. Oh, Abfab. Yeah, Abfab. So, yeah, on this one, it was... Um, I done started with half the board liquid clear and half the board liquid black. I blended them together, only halfway and then come up with that. Uh, I'm just gonna little, put a little bit of snow on the top there. A little bit more white. There we go. Yeah, I think it's all right. Amazing, Cole. Well done. Thanks for everyone for, for for staying here tonight. I appreciate that. I know it's been a bit slower and longer, but um, there was some more sort of finer detail bits in it. So, uh, yeah. 
So yeah, overall, I'm pretty sort of happy with that. Completely different picture, isn't it? I mean, it's a close-up sort of mountain. Love this, mate. Titch, thank you very much. Well, 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 you've excelled yourself tonight. Thank you very much, Jim. Much appreciated. Yeah, it looked nice up on the wall. I love the way the rocks come together. Got a little little pokey bit going up there. Be nice to do something like this again. Um, maybe sort of a different angle. Maybe no hills, so it's just flat down the bottom. Trees and maybe some water. So it gives us a bit of a idea to do it again. Thanks for everyone tapping the screen tonight and um, obviously being here again. Thank you and I hope you've enjoyed it. A bigger one? Cool, yeah. What, on a bigger canvas? Yeah, I've, this is the biggest canvas I've ever done. Um, which is, you know, the normal sort of 30 by 40. Yeah, I, have, I, I mean, I've got some on my Amazon wish list. I haven't managed to get any yet, but um, a 30 by 40, I think this bit would come sort of way up there. And I think I think it will make using the palette knife easier, but uh, I don't know. I don't know, because like, sometimes when I'm using the, the normal sort of palette knife size, sort of this sort of size, it can be tricky, even though you've got the other side of the palette knife. But now I've got I've got these small ones as well, so that's good for these size paintings. Try it, yeah. I'll have to, yeah. I'll have to. Right, I'll say good night, everyone. Everyone have a nice um, weekend. I might be on tomorrow night. I might be. There's a possibility that I might be on. Um, so I might see you tomorrow, and I might not. Right, I'll say good night. I'll give you a chance to say good night, and then. Um, I'll see you next time. It looks bigger as it's the other way round. Yeah, that's true. That's true, actually, yeah. Yeah, because if I was to get sort of... Um... Yeah, it definitely does, actually. Yeah, no, no, everyone. Thanks for being here again. And I'll say good night. Night, night, Carl. Night, everyone. Thank you. So, good night, Jerry. Thanks for being here. Thanks, everyone, for the gifts tonight. Much appreciated. And I'll see you next time. Bye, 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 bye.